<laughs> this is my brother. This is Leif Erikson. Dumb brother of the family. Maybe I should keep my glasses on so I can see, huh? Patriarch. Was that Christian meeting? He called you the Patriarch? Yeah, Bishop. Yeah, I'm going to call it a Patriarch of the family. By a missionary. Yeah. I have control. Hey, what's up, man? <laughs> the power of the video camera. <laughs> Park it yourself, Metallica, bro. <laughs> It's a wicked game. Skills. Board ball is to Mormons what Taekwondo is to Koreans. 
Mormon kids will need these skills when they're called on missions to places so rough and obscure that even the angels have to look them up in an atlas before appearing to tread there. The second degree of ward ball glory is a varsity ward team. These are 18 to 30 something priesthood holders, suedo jocks with intense attitudes about the celestial nature of ward ball. These guys shoot. <laughs> no, the gospel isn't the problem. It's instructors that have fallen into the trap of mindlessly scrolling down a list of prepared simplistic questions until you wonder if they missed being born as fence posts by virtue of a limited cerebral cortex. If Sunday school teachers, school teachers teach you anything other than how to sleep with your eyes open, it's by accident rather than design. Which brings us to the purpose and disclaimer of this book. Please make a note of it. Sunday of the Living Dead is not intended to be a replacement for the official mm -hmm. church manuals. However, however, if you spare me, this book can serve as a teaching supplement. You may want to check with the bishop first, though. For the sake of alleviating a little church boredom, there's no point in angering the guy who can give you a job in the ward nursery. You may have been afraid that Sunday school was slowly killing you, but you get stuck in the nursery and you wish it had. So whether Sunday of the Living Dead makes you mad or makes you laugh, it will hope you keep you, hopefully keep you awake. If it does, that puts us one up on the manual. <laughs>